Please subscribe to this channel and also tap the notification bell in order for you not to miss out on any of our videos. New elements have been found in the Amugu Belinga, Maxim Eko Eko and the Bruno Bijang file. New clues point to the tip of their nose in the Amugu Belinga, Maxim Eko Eko and Bruno Bijang case at the SED. Indeed, it would seem that one of the cars of the head of intelligence, Maxim Eko Eko, detained for about nine days already, would have participated in the operation of kidnapping and the assassination of Martinez Zogo. According to the whistleblower Boris Betold, who relates the case, the boss of the Directorate General for External Research, DGRE, Maxim Eko Eko, who has been in police custody for about nine days at the SED, will no longer be able to resume his duties at the DGRE visibly. The latter so far refutes all the accusations made against him and he denies any involvement in the assassination of the journalist Martinez Zogo, but the chief of operations, Justin Dawe, says the opposite. According to the revelations of Boris Betold, investigators have in their possession surveillance images, photos which indicate that one of the cars used in the operation of shadowing, kidnapping and the assassination of Martinez Zogo was part of the parking lot of Maxim Eko Eko. Plus that, Justin Danway indicates that the equipment used in the operation was only possible with the authorization of the DGRE, Maxim Eko Eko. The latter also rejects the accusations as a whole. This case has not yet said its last words in terms of twists and turns, because Bruno Bijang's wife was also arrested and taken to the SED this morning with her 14-month-old baby.